hearts do fear the smallest monstrous mouse that creeps on the floor may now perchance both quake and tremble here when lion rough in the wildest range doth roar. Then know that I, as snug the joiner, am a lion fell, nor else no lions. Damn. Oh. For if I should, as a lion, come in strife, into this place to her pity on my life. A very gentle beast and of good conscience. The very best in beast, my lord, that ever I saw. The lion is very fox for his valor. True, and a goose for his discretion. Not so, my lord. The valor cannot carry his discretion, and the fox carries the goose. His discretion, I am sure, does not carry his valor, for the goose carries not the fox. It is well. Neither to the, his discretion and love is looking to the goose. <laughs> this place, this place, doth the horned moon present. He should have worn the horns on his head. He is no crescent, and his horns are invisible within the circumference. This place, or doth the horned moon present. Myself, the man I am, the mere do seem to me. This is the greatest error of all the rest. The man should be put into the land door. How is it else the I, the man I of the moon? He dares not come there for the candle, for you see, it is already in snuff. I am aware of this moon, what he would change. It appears by his small light of discretion that he is the wane, but yet in courtesy and all reason he must stay the time. Proceed, moon. All that I have to say is to tell you that in the land thorn is the moon. I, the man, I am the moon. This thorn bush, my thorn bush, and this dog, my dog. Why all these should be in the land thorn, for all these are in the moon. But silence, here comes this view. <laughs> <laughs> what? This is old Ninny's tomb. Where is my love?